everybody, this is Julie with ReadySitStamp.com and today we're going to be making a cute little gumball card. And so what I'm going to do is just start putting on these pieces here. I've got a little piece that I cut out that kind of looks like metal and it's um, this gray paper but it has a little bit of shimmer to it and I just got it in Michaels and it was like out of their recollections or recollections. I always call it recollections. I call it the wrong thing. Um, but it, I got it out of that section there. So um, let me just go ahead and fix my tape gun here. It's give, been give, giving me a little bit of headache lately and I don't know why. All right. So there is that piece there and I've got this one on here. The next step that I'm going to do, this needs to be added to it. So let's go ahead and add the red part. Of course you can cut it, cut it in whatever color that you would like and it has the base here that's one piece that you just glue things onto like this. This doesn't look like this is sticking very well onto here so I'm just going to get a little bit more glue and tuck that in there. There we go, that's a little better. Okay, and I stamped it with Simple Sentiments from the Scrappy Moms stamp set, which is a really cute one. It's got some sweet sentiments onto there. It was kind of gumming up on me too much, so I've just switched over to my Zig 2A glue pen because that was not working for me. So I'm just going to go in between where I did the um, glue gun, and we'll just put this right in here. Not glue gun, but tape gun. <laughs> Okay, so there's that, and now I'm going to put the little tiny piece that goes on top here, a little bit of this little pin, and it's got a cute little lid or top to this thing here. So there's that. So now what we need to do is put the little pieces that go onto here, and I think I'm going to do these little pieces. I just cut a bunch of them out because I'm normally I do always one-of-a-kind cards, but I have a few that I need to make, and they kind of worked for the all occasion. Like this one's a happy birthday. I need to do a couple thank yous. And I thought, well, gumball's kind of a cute little idea. So anyway, I'm just going to do that. So I'm going to get out my little zots here. And, of course, I could do, if I wanted to, I could do the uh, glue pen. But I'm just going to go ahead and just put these on with this. So I'm just going to keep doing these pieces here. And kind of overlapping them a bit and we'll come back but I'm just gonna keep doing like rows and rows and rows of these and then we will come back and I'll show you what it looks like when it's all finished here okay here's my completed little gumball card which I think is so cute and another fun way if you want to do sequins instead of these dots if you want to do some of these brads in there there's some rhinestones if you wanted to do that to really jazz this up a little bit. I think that would be really cute. So anyway, I, want, I did want to keep this kind of flat because I'm mailing this. And so anyway, I just decided to do it this way. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this. And of course, for those of you that like stickles, that would be a good idea to kind of add some little shimmer to this too. What I prefer to do, since I don't like waiting for paint to dry, <laughs> so what I prefer is use like glitter paper. So I don't know if you can tell, but this the silver does have a little bit of uh, a glitter effect to it, or a little shimmer effect rather than glitter, I should say. I don't know if this is picking it up or not, but that's what I prefer to do. I prefer to just cut the paper with little fun little sparkles in it rather than waiting for paint to dry. But that's just me, so whatever you guys prefer. And right now, today is September 17th, and up until this Saturday on the 20th, the paper is on sale right now at Michael's for seven for one dollar. So that is a fabulous deal. And those paper pads that they were offering, I showed you guys a little while ago, they're back to five dollars again. So anyway, just giving you a little tip on that. Hope you guys are having a fabulous day. Take care, everybody. Bye bye.